Hello and good afternoon guys. Today we're joined with the lovely Sky from All My Shakes. Um, so Sky, can you please introduce yourself and tell us a bit more about your business venture? Yeah, so I'm Sky. I am the founder of Oh My Shakes. Um, so I started this back in May yeah. last year mm -hmm. of lockdown. Yeah. Um, it was just a spur of the moment kind of thing. Um, it, it just happened. It was just a little idea. Yeah. Um, so I was thinking I could see that everybody during lockdown was just doing sweets mm -hmm. and everything that you possibly could do, obviously yeah, yeah. at such difficult times. So um, I got the idea then to go along with the sweets, the sweet kind of part, yeah, yeah. to then put it on top of like a milkshake. Okay. So I was like, oh, oh my gosh, <laughs> oh my shake. And then that's obviously where the name has come from. Oh, so that, what, the name came across you just saying that, oh my gosh, yeah. oh my shake. And I just what? thought, oh my gosh, great <laughs> idea. Yeah, yeah. Shakes. And then I was like, oh my shakes. And, oh, I, and it's just clear. gone from there. So what did you do then? Did you just like, after that happened, what was your next move? Um, so my next move, um, because so what happened was I created my own shake at home. Yeah. And then posted it onto my own um, Instagram. Yeah. And then the response I got from that was fantastic. Okay. And people were like, are you delivering? Yeah. Where can I get this? Where did you get this? Yeah, and yeah. And obviously I was like, it's myself. Yeah. So I let it go down for two days. This was on a Sunday. Mm -hmm. And then I thought, you know what? I'm going to make a page. Yeah. Give it a go. Why not? Of Something course. to do. Mm -hmm. Lovely. Gave it a go, done the page, and since then it's just been booming, booming, which I'm so so grateful for. Yeah, I mean, obviously earlier we spoke as well. Like you said, um, how you started it, like in terms of funding. Um, yeah. Do you want to tell us a bit more about that? Yeah. So um, I'm obviously a student, so yeah. you can imagine finance finances for a student it's not is <laughs> not the best yeah, until yeah. the loan drops. You know. Yeah. So um, it was May last year. So. The fa my finances, like I said, weren't, weren't too good. Yeah. Um, then got the help from my parents to start up with my ingredients and what's, what, whatsoever. Yeah. Um, and then done local lockdown deliveries. Done yeah. a few markets in the fire break when the lockdown res lift restrictions were lifted. Yeah. Um, and then obviously got this unit here. Mm -hmm. But um, since then, the financial side of it, in yeah. terms of how fantastic the business has gone, it's up. gone from nothing yeah. to a house deposit in the matter of year, of wow. a, coming up to a year now. Just one year? Just one year. So, so it's wow. booming. Yeah. That's quite interesting because, like, you went from zero to a house deposit, but, like, genuinely all you were thinking about was innovating in a sense because you're seeing everyone's doing the same thing, yeah. but you wanted to do something like that, make your money, Which but you didn't know how to do it differently and then obviously sure. came across the milkshakes. That's yeah, sick. Yeah, for sure. Wow. And I haven't, obviously you see milkshakes, you see cream, you see whatever, but yeah. you know, a milkshake and a cake on top. On top of each other, that's mad. You know, the, the toppings, you can create your own, Yeah. you can do it to your, to whatever your preference, whatever you so prefer. You're just going crazy with it, basically. You can mix like, it, yeah. yeah, absolutely crazy. Freak shakes is what they're called, go wild, freak you know. Shakes, What's the freak shakes like? The freak shakes come with the large cake. Oh so my is God. a cake, a donut, yeah. a cookie or a muffin. On top Cake of and a shake. shake, yeah. <laughs> Cake and a shake. Oh my. <laughs> so I want to ask you as well. When you were younger, like, yeah. what type of person were you? Like, were you motivated with like, I don't know, monetary things like, um, I don't know, cars or money or, or were you just more of like a humble, chilled out person who just yeah. wanted to live life normal in a sense? Do you yeah, know what I, mean? I would say more of a humble, chilled person. Mm -hmm. Um. I try to give, I'm the type of person I want to give out, like, give out my all to everybody. Yeah, yeah. Um, but a very creative person at the same time. Yeah. So, to, like, and, du and during lockdown, to know I set this up during lockdown, and, like, when I would deliver to yeah. local, the, the reactions and, like, the smiles on people's faces during Just such a difficult time yeah, was course. fab. Like, yeah, yeah. And, like, how people come in now and they're like, oh! <gasps> Is that my milkshake? And I'm like, yeah, that's what I yeah. do. Like, you know, I like to see other people happy and smiling and stuff. And for me, it's, it's not even about getting the money for house deposits. Yeah, not, yeah. not like that. Yeah, of course. It's like I'm making people smile from just my creativity. Yeah, yeah. That's fab, you know, and yeah, I love I to do that. Always done little bits on this side. Yeah. Have worked like part time and stuff, but it's just never been for me. Not for you. Never. Yeah, yeah, like, I get it. And I'm like, I just don't know why. And mm -hmm. the like, I just Tell go to. Starbucks. Starbucks, I would go to, like, I would go to work, yeah. and I would just be thinking, oh, I could be doing this to myself, to myself. you and know? That, yeah, yeah, I could yeah. be taking my dreams for myself, for myself by doing that. Yeah. But I've, I've always wanted to be my own boss, but mm -hmm. I could, 
I've never actually, it's, it was like a dream. Yeah. So like still now it hasn't hit me. So I'm still that thinking, you're on, you're on boss. oh, it feels like, oh, I'm working in all my shit. So yeah, it's just yeah. like, <laughs> it's not me. You know, it just I, don't feel like that just yet. No, of course. But it's been so overwhelming and so fantastic. And like I said, I'm still in uni. Mm -hmm. So you can imagine trying to do my uni work. Well, I come up seven days a week. So I'm sat in here, do my uni, uni work, work yeah. and serving. Wow. But then what else would I be like? Doing. What else exactly. is there for me you, to what do? you going to do? Work for and someone else? And this is for me. Like, yeah, this yeah. feels fab, you know? Nah, that's pretty sick. I mean, through the pandemic, um, obviously it wasn't easy. You know, starting no, a business, you know what I mean? All. How did you, like, get all the connections which you have now? So, like, setting yourself up here at Lakeside View. Yeah, so, you know? um, like I said, I went, during the fire breaks, went to the Corp Yard, Corporation Yard. Yeah, yeah. So there was, like, markets going on there. Yeah. Um, with other small traders. So I met loads of different traders along the way. Yeah. And, like, picking up tips, picking up how to do things, how to, you know. Okay, so learning and on the And then, job, obviously, met a load of new people. And then they were like, you know, we're going to Lakeside. And I yeah. was like, oh, wow. And they're like, we've got space if you want it. And it just come up like that. And I yeah. was like, yeah, okay, why not? Because yeah, I'm like more it. of a, give it a good, like, a trier. Yeah, so, yeah, So, like, yeah. I don't mind if it comes crashing down. Because... Mm -hmm. It, that boosts At me to keep going, like, you know what I mean? Yes, yeah, yeah. So then, obviously, now being here, met loads of different people. Yeah. It's just going and going and going. And, like, the thing, the people that you meet are incredible. Like, yeah. love, like, meeting customers. And they're like, oh, yeah, I do this. Or oh, I've started that. So you just link oh, up I've done more this. And you're like, wow, yeah. this is what's going on. No, Whereas, cool. like, because I was, a, obviously, a student, so I'm just doing the student side of things, going yeah. out and the drink, laughing with my friends, socialising. Now it's like socialising with a complete new group. New group of people. So it's like, oh, they're doing that. They're making that. They're trying to do this. They're yeah, yeah. It's like wow, and that's why I like. It's like, like uplifting in that's a sense. Nice. Yeah, yeah. Cause you so yourself motivating. With like, I don't know, five different people who are doing businesses. Let's say, do you know what I mean? You're gonna look at them every day, like, oh, okay, so he made this much today. All right, I need yeah. to better that tomorrow. But like, that's the type of competition you want. Do you yeah, know what I'm yeah, saying? for sure. I mean, I think I've seen earlier on your story that you're doing a little collaboration with um, Dee's Kitchen. And yes, I'm pretty sure yeah. she started, like, during the pandemic as well. Yeah. Which is pretty sick. So, like, how have you been going through, like, doing these collaborations and, you know, linking up with these other people to kind of grow each other? As yeah, well, yeah, like, for I mean? sure. I think that's, that's the best part about it, you know, meeting other businesses mm. who are happy to support you yes. as well as you supporting, supporting them, them and yeah. to grow with one another rather than being bitter. Yeah, and, and in, on in that competition spiteful and stuff, yeah, yeah, yeah. What do you I'm, think of that? Have you had any, like... Bitterness, hate, um, or anything? Yeah, I've had this? a few. I've had a few things. So I've had a few other. Um, so I use Facebook Marketplace as my marketing. Okay. So I use that as a marketing platform to yeah. put this on Marketplace to spread it out. Mm -hmm. I then also use Instagram. Yeah. And I've obviously got a website and Uber Eats and what have you. Mm -hmm. But the one time I did go on to Facebook Marketplace and wow, I had it was almost like a troll. You could say. Yeah, what happened? And it ran on for four days. Yeah. So what happened was I posted in a Newport buy and sell. Mm -hmm. So there's all, obviously all different pages on Marketplace. You can yeah, yeah. Whatever. So I posted in there and um, I had a comment from, from just a fake profile. And mm. it was like, you haven't got a hygiene, you haven't had your company, blah, blah, oh. blah. So I thought, oh, wow. Well, it's COVID. So yeah. there's a real big log back of, of course, hygiene. That. Yeah, so yeah. That's, that can't be happening on a waiting list. Mm. And we are a registered company. So I made sure I posted that on there to say. Just to let them know. But this this page, well, this person behind the account didn't, not at all. It was four days straight. Wow. It was continuous. And then there was comments of um, five pounds for a milkshake to pay for all her Botox. And I was like, Whoa, oh, so you just sent don't need shots. Botox. <laughs> <laughs> First of all, I ain't got Botox. Um, but yeah, um, that's mad. You know, so it is like you can use Facebook and benefit. Mm -hmm. And then obviously there's the downsides to it. The whereas tools. you find people who are really going in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, looking and searching. But <coughs> they were, and then what happened from that was because where I come back to say, look, you know, yeah. we're awaiting a hygiene rating. Yeah. We are registered. This is our certificate. This is this. Yeah. Well, the publicity off that. Crazy, the like. amount of pit likes that I got on my Facebook page from it okay. was fantastic. Okay. And like at the first, I was like, oh no, he's taking, he's taking it, he's taking the yeah. business. Ah. And then I was like, oh my gosh. He has like now, yeah, I'd yeah. love to know who's behind the page. <laughs> Just to say thank he you. or she to say, look, <laughs> shake my hand. Hey, listen, thank you, whoever did that. <laughs> yeah, you know, but that's pretty sick. So like, this hater or this troll, basically kind of like, grew your business. 
He did. A little bit. She do you know what I mean? Did. He yeah, or yeah. she did it. They were thought they were trolling, gonna get you down. Yeah. But you use that as like motivation. You made like, okay, cool, I'm coming for you. Basically, uh-huh, you get for me? sure. Yeah. No, that's class. That's class. So like, with the milkshake ideas and flavors, yeah. Yeah. Do you ever run out of like ideas and flavors? Or like, so, let's say for instance, I came into your shop and said, yo, listen, I want banana, bacon, and let's say an apple or something in a milkshake. How crazy does that sound? I would think, ah, really? <laughs> do you really want all that? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but me being me would say, all right. Let's do it. Put it in. Okay. Try it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me know. Don't like it, doing something else. Do something else. Yeah. But if you like it, obviously. Definitely. So obviously you said about let me know, try it. And that's kind of what you've been doing, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, just yeah, yeah. Like, Whatever you want to do, you just go for it, you try it, and if it flops, whatever, life yeah. it is, do you know what I'm saying? But this now, this has really taken a huge turn. Like, yeah. it's, it's, you know, like, it, feel, it feels like as if it's my kid. Like, yeah. it's like, <laughs> I'm gonna oh, imagine, this yeah, is yeah. mine. Like, you know, <laughs> it it's, is you like... look after it and things. And, like, I come up and I'm, I'm cleaning and there's yeah. nothing to clean. And, like, I'm just looking at it. I, I, I love it. Yeah. Stuff. I mean, yeah, you're right. It is your baby, like, you it get is. me? And, like, so, because it's your baby, your baby takes growth. What kind of growth do you want to see in the next couple months couple um, years, so like. since I since I've started it now and I've seen how it's going right so my dream would be to franchise the business okay, yeah obviously five ten years time yeah yeah um, and just take it to other places so then I can still go into my professional degree yeah and which is which is psychology with counseling okay yeah. so going down that path yeah whilst I've got this as a franchise run by others yeah 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 okay. so that that is my dream so delegating basically yeah the franchise for other people to come make their money as well for whilst sure. you're still doing your professional yeah. degree. okay i mean what, what made you take psychology actually um That's i'm all about the mind yeah so like i'd like i'd love to know how and why people behave in certain, in certain ways. ways yeah I, you know what i'm so interested in that as well i mean jordan peterson i don't know if you've read his books but He's the best guy for that, you get me? Really, yeah. Yeah, and he's just always, like, talking about it's down to you to go and change your life. Yeah, for sure. Do you know sure, what I'm saying? There's sure. nobody who's going to be out there trying to say to you, like, listen, mate, you need to go do this, or listen, mate, you can't do that. Yeah. He just says, go and do it. Yeah, yeah. You, It's your body, it's your life, go and do it, do you know what I'm yeah. saying? And that's what I kind of see from you as well, like, just starting up this business and starting having um, the other business, having uni. You're really, like, resilient. Yeah, you yeah, I mean, yeah. just keep going and going together, like you get yeah, me? yeah, for so sure. Like, what brings that motivation daily? Like, um, how, like, do you wake I up like depressed sometimes, feeling like, oh, this is long, or like, what happens? I think no one, you can only motivate yourself. Yeah, yeah. And I say, so for this, I say I believed I could, and I did. Ooh, sorry. So, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. I feel that's how you need to be. So you need to yeah. be a very strong-minded individual. Yeah. To think, look. I want to do this, and I'm, I'm going to do this, mm-hmm. and I'm going to see where it goes. Yeah, weird. If it don't, it don't. It don't, innit? Yeah. Do something else. Were you scared of failure? Um, Were you scared of that? Like? I did think after the deliveries, I thought, oh, you know, it's gone. Because it, there was a time where it went quiet. Yeah. And I thought, oh, it's gone. Don't worry, though. I was yeah. like, don't worry about it. Just tell it's yourself, fine. don't worry, it's good. And then I thought, you know, keep, keep touting it, keep mm-hmm. doing it, keep posting. Yeah. And boom. Come back again. Got a unit. Got yeah. a van, got this, got that. And it just keeps ticking over and ticking over. And so many opportunities are like, I feel that for me, mm-hmm. it's like, you know, do your bit. Yeah. But, and then like, kind of like manifest for your bit and just, just relax. Yeah. What, yeah. what, like, what will be, will be. Will be in it. And yeah. everything happens for a reason. So, like, now if I'm, was thinking, oh, I'd love to do a radio station interview. Yeah. Radio station interview comes up. Do it. Done it with BBC Wales. Yeah. Lovely. Then I'm like, do you know what? I'd like to take it to somewhere else. Mm-hmm. Then I've been given opportunities for Pondy Creek, Newport, Cardiff Bay. Yeah, so yeah. I'm thinking it is slowly falling into place. Like, you've got to be on it. Yeah. But sit back a little. Don't and chase what will it, be, basically. Will be. It'll come if yeah, it's yeah, yeah. Na- like I believe in natural. So if it's, if it's for me, mm-hmm. it'll come to me. Yeah, yeah. You know, like, you've got to put the work in. My gosh, I've put so <laughs> much work in. Yeah. So much work in. And like, for, for me, I've done everything. I've styled the menus myself. Mm-hmm. I've printed them myself. Like, it's all my touch. The whole thing, all you. And, like, all my write-ups for myself. Like, Pambe said to me the other day, yeah. oh, did you write that? And I You're was like, like yeah. Of course I did. <laughs> and he's like, it's like bloody Shakespeare. <laughs> 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 he's a joke. <laughs> Shakespeare. It was great. Right? It was great. Nah, that's class, though. That's jokes, bro. I mean, when am I going to try one of these milkshakes, though? Because, like, they're looking... 
crazy. I mean, what's your favourite milkshake? Mine is the mint. The mint one, yeah? yeah? Mint? Uh, mint so Aero. Oh, really? Nice. Refreshing. Little chocolate bits in there. Yeah. Donut on top. Nice. Is that the one you'd recommend to people if they were to come here? Yeah, mints. The most popular are Oreo. Yeah. A Buono is still popular. Buono, okay. Yeah, and the Lotus. What's a lo oh, the Lotus, Lotus Biscoff yeah. things, isn't it? Yeah, people yeah, raving yeah. about those at the minute. Ooh. Okay, so you've just been doing milkshakes from them and that. Yeah. I mean, that's pretty sick to be honest, guys. You get me? I mean, you inspired me as well because I was just looking like, oh, yo, you've done this for one year. And, you know, you're, you're where, you're, where you are at at the present moment, you get me? And it's like... It doesn't seem believable, does it? No, nah, do like, you know what I'm saying? Wow. But it is, it's achievable. Yeah, And that's for the sure. thing. And this for is sure. what I want to bring out to people. Like, these things can be done. Yeah, you get me? for you sure. You can, you know, doubt yourself all you want. People will doubt you, whatever. But at the end of the day, if you believe in yourself... Yeah. On like and people do it. are like, oh, you sell milkshake. <laughs> yes, yeah, I do. Oh my shakes. Oh my shakes. In Lakeside, check out. that's where we are. We right. we sell milkshakes. Yeah, <laughs> no, you know. Not, I mean, you must get that a lot. are nice. You yeah, know? Yo, they are, are nice. banging. They are banging. But like, what was the USP though? Because like, milkshake places, they're hard. Some places are hard to like, you know, I don't know, penetrate the market. Because you got places like um, Casper's. Yeah. You know, Coco Gelato. Yeah. So. What made you think, yo, okay, Oh My Shakes is going to top these one day, do you get me, and, and, and just go off? I'm hoping for that. I think with this, it's such the twist of having them fully loaded, so like with the cake on top. Okay, yes, yeah. With the mini donuts on top. With being able to mix the flavours. Yeah, yeah. You can, you can do anything, you know? Up, yeah. You can come here and tell me, you know, I want watermelon, I want this, and I want banana, and I'm like, I can do that for I you. I can do it for you. I can yeah. do it for you. I no like, problem at all. that sets you apart, though? Like yeah, everything. for sure. I think that's what the, the difference is in this. Like I always say, you know, didn't invent milkshakes, knowing that I never invented them. Yeah. But I've created my own with a twist. So you've innovated, you basically. Know? Yeah, for sure. I was having sure. a convo for earlier sure. with someone, because um, they said, like, why would you open up a, I don't know, a chicken shop or something? Um, or why would you do, like, a, um, a podcast or something? And I thought to myself, well, first of all, I want to do it. Do you yeah. know what I mean? First and foremost, because I want to do it. Second of all, I could probably do it better. Do you get me? Yeah, you just yeah. think to yourself, yeah, I could probably do it better. Yeah. And then, last of all, it's like, it's my business. Do you know what I mean? If, if I want to do it personally, yeah. I will do it. And it's like, that's what I see from you. And just, yeah, it's been sick, really. Like, the whole journey. I mean, what is next now, though, for you personally? I know you said, obviously, you're going to be going into events and everything else. You've got the van and stuff. But, like, yes. you personally, what's next? Um, so Any more other businesses you want to try and attack? Do you do so investments on the sides or anything like? I uh, know. So just uni. Yeah. Um, and this now. Yeah. So like I said, just want to finish uni, get my degree. Yeah. Go down that path that whilst path. taking this a lot further. Okay. Want to put my all into this yeah. and my all into uni. Yeah. And then, like I said, if anything comes up, or comes up what it? will be will be. Obviously, looking once I get like different areas, want to have sit down, yeah. expand the menu, you know, crazy things, get bigger. Things, and get yeah. bigger and I mean, bigger. you've also uh, changed your logo, right? Yeah, yeah, I'm in the I'm in the process of having a little twist on it. Tell us about that, please. Um, so obviously, like I said, when I started, it was a spur of the moment thing. I've yeah. never been the type of girl to be into pink. Yeah. So for me now, I'm opening my eyes and it's pink. I'm closing my eyes and it's pink, and I'm just thinking, <laughs> ah, <Right pink. laughs> yeah, yeah. need to need to get it gone. Mm -hmm. And I just think. Um, so for me now, I'm thinking to go into the like green, sky blue, mint type of theme. Yeah. So I'm thinking of changing it up to a minty colour, just mm -hmm. to look more refreshing. Yeah. And like I said, for me, sky, sky blue. Sky blue, of course, it makes sense. Get it in a bit. Yeah, yeah, you got to, you got to. <laughs> I know what you mean. No, but so. to be fair, Sky, it's been great having this chat. Where can people find you? Um, so you we are on Instagram at ohmyshakes underscore. Mm -hmm. We're on Facebook at ohmyshakes. And then obviously our location is Lakeside, yeah. Clear Waterway. You should definitely come back on again as well. Awesome. You know what I mean?